Hello everyone. Welcome to Novation. I'm Shantanu and I welcome you all to the March 2020 current affairs session. And before we move to the video, I just want to say that uh, I hope every one of you is fine and is in your home and is taking necessary precautions against the coronavirus. And uh, if we'll take all the necessary precautions, I'm sure uh, we are going to, you know, defeat this uh, novel virus as soon as possible. So uh, without any further ado, let's start with the session. Also, you can contact me on any of the social platforms if you have any doubts regarding your preparations or simply you need the PDF of this video. Okay, so let's start the session. The first question for today, name the country which has become the first country in the world to make all public transports free. Friends, the correct answer is C, Luxembourg. It's a European country and it has made all the public transports free in the country. So let's see the PTN. So in an attempt to reduce the traffic jams, this this uh, the main reason for uh, the traffic jams, Luxembourg uh, took the, it became the first country in the world to make all public transport free from January 29. Okay, let's move forward. A co-branded credit card, Kaching, was launched by which of these airlines in collaboration with HDFC Bank and Mastercard? Friends, the name of the credit card is Kaching and uh, the name of the airline is Indigo. Indigo has uh, collaborated with HDFC and Mastercard. So this credit card will uh, provide certain benefits like uh, lounge access, priority check-ins at the airport, discounted convenience, etc. to all the customers of uh, Indigo. Moving ahead, who among the following launched the Suposhit Ma Abhyan? Friends, the correct answer is Mr. Om Birla and he is the speaker of our Lok Sabha. Let's see the PTN. So the main objective of this campaign is to keep pregnant women and newborn healthy. And it was launched uh, from Kota, but this program will be uh, extended to all over the country. And for now, in the first phase, around 1000 kits of 17 kg balanced diet was provided to 1000 pregnant women in the first phase of the implementation of Suposhit Mahabhyan. That's a very important uh, program. So do remember it. Moving ahead. Next is in which of the following cities, India's first commercial LNG, that is liquefied com compressed natural gas bus has been launched. So the first commercial LNG bus that has been launched in A, Kochi. Let's see the PTN. So this bus has been created by Petronet. That's, this is the name of the company. And this bus is fitted with 180 uh, kg of tank. And the bus can travel of, uh, up till around uh, 900 kilometers if the uh, this tank is filled once. Okay. So do remember the name of the company and the place also. Moving ahead, which of these cities has recorded the highest number of digital payments in India in 2019 as per World Line India Digital Payments 2019 report? So as per this report, B. Bangalore has witnessed the highest number of digital payments in 2019 in our country. So after Bangalore, uh, the rank was of Chennai, Mumbai and Pune. So if we talk about states, so Maharashtra was the number one states in, in the digital payment seg segment. Uh, so uh, do remember the state and the city. Moving ahead, who among the following countries has taken over as president of the UN Security Council for the month of March 2020? Okay, so the correct answer is B, China. Friends, what happens is every month, uh, one of the member of UN Security Council becomes the president of the UN Security Council. So this uh, in March, uh, China has taken over as the president. So the council presidency is a capacity that rotates every month among its 15 members. So friends, there are 15 members and five permanent members of uh, UN Security Council. So do uh, search about them. Okay, moving ahead. Next question. Name the mobile app launched by the government which will provide housing societies, hotels and hospitals in NCR region with doorstep diesel delivery. Friends, the correct answer is A. Hamsafar. So this is the app through which doorstep delivery of fuel like diesel can be achieved. So this app will be used for the fuel delivery services to housing societies, hotels, malls, construction sites, etc. where in the NCR region. Okay, moving ahead. Government said that out of 34 crore account holders account uh, opened under uh, Pradhan Mantri Jandhan Yojana around dash percent are women account holder. So out of these 34 crores, how many, uh, how much percent are women account holders? The correct answer is C, 60%. So a huge uh, chunk of these 34 crore accounts belong to women. Okay, moving ahead. 
Uttarakhand will now have two state capitals with dash as its summer capital. So friends, the correct answer is A. Gaiarsan, it is the uh, it is decided as the summer capital of Uttarakhand. Let's see the PTN. So uh, Gaiarsan is the summer capital. So which is the winter capital? It is Dehradun. Dehradun will be the will still be the winter capital of uh, Uttarakhand. Moving ahead. Name the first ever cryptocurrency exchange in India to integrate bank account transfers. Friends, the correct answer is Coin DCX. It is uh, an Indian origin uh, uh, Bitcoin and cryptocurrency exchange, and this uh, uh, news has came out after Reserve Bank of India has actually lifted the ban which was put on uh, cryptocurrencies and the exchanges uh, operating in cryptocurrencies after Supreme Court made them legal. Okay, so correct uh, correct answer is Coin DCX. Moving ahead, the Badminton World Federation, that is BWF, has shifted the Asia Championships 2020 from Wuhan, China, to which of the following places? Friends, the correct answer is C, Manila, which is the capital of Philippines. Why they have shifted uh, it from Wuhan? Because Wuhan is the epicenter of uh, this uh, uh, novel uh, coronavirus, so uh, it has been shifted to Manila. Moving ahead. ICICI Prudential AMC Limited has tied up with which of the following urban cooperative banks in order to offer investment product to its customer. Friends, the correct answer is Saraswat Cooperative Bank, which is one of the biggest urban cooperative banks in India. And uh, it has joined hand with ICICI Prudential and it will be offering its citizens, uh, I'm sorry, its customers with the investment products of uh, ICICI Prudential. I hope that's clear. Moving ahead. Name the deputy governor of RBI who has re who will quit his position by 31st March 2020, three months ahead of his re uh, retirement, citing health reasons. Friends, the correct answer is B. Anesh uh, Vishwanathan. He is going to quit uh, uh, from his post. Uh, he'll take early retirement because of health reasons. Moving ahead, as per UN economists. There will be a drop of how many percentage point in worldwide FDI, that is uh, foreign direct investment, due to novel coronavirus outbreak. Friends, the correct answer is C, 15%. So you can imagine that's a huge percentage. Uh, this much FDI in all over the world is going to decrease due to this uh, coronavirus. Moving ahead. Uh, let's see the PTN first. So the UN agency pointed to estimates that growth in the global economy will slow bit slow down between 0.5 to 1.5 percent this year. So usually it is around 2 percent. It is going to be, uh, it will decrease and it will reach around 0.5 to 1.5 percent. That is the growth in the global economy is going to, uh, you know, decrease severely. Moving ahead. SBI plans to invest a maximum of how many crores in Yes Bank? Friends, SBI is going to invest rupees 10,000 crore in uh, Yes Bank, which is facing a huge crisis this time uh, presently. Uh, let's see the PTN. So Yes Bank will need at least 22,000 crores and around half of which will come from non-SBI investors, they say. SBI will be putting around 10,000 crores and uh, SBI has around has bought around 49% stake in Yes Bank. So uh, actually SBI has a huge role in bailing out Yes Bank. And what's the crisis going on? Yes, Bank is facing huge amount of NPAs, which was given to various uh, industrialists, and now they are unable to recover their loans. You can please go ahead and uh, you know read more about it. Moving ahead, which team won the ICICI Women's T20 World Cup for the record fifth time? Can you can you believe uh, fifth time? The correct answer is A, Australia. So recently, Australia uh, beaten India in the finals. And uh, they are they are also the defending uh, champions uh, in cricket World Cup. So they uh, India lost uh, uh, to Australia with around 85 runs. In uh, the final was in Melbourne Cricket Ground in Australia. Moving ahead, which of the following states is going to launch digital literacy drive? I am also digital. So this is the name of the drive, and the correct answer is D Kerala. Kerala is going to launch this digital drive. And what's its aim? Its aim is to spread awareness about e-governance. That is, people can easily access to government, uh, you know, resources and all the facilities on the internet itself. And uh, they also want to encourage through this program digital payments. Okay, moving ahead. Who among the following has been recently been named as the BBC Indian Sports Women of the Year? Friends, the correct answer is T. 
पी वी सिंधु द स्टार शटलर ऑफ इंडिया मूविंग अहेड द मेन नेशनल इवेंट फॉर द सिक्स इंटरनेशनल डे ऑफ योगा आई डी वाई विल बी हेल्ड एट विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग प्लेसिस फ्रेंड्स इट विल बी हेल्ड इन ले विच इज़ द कैपिटल ऑफ लद्दाख सो दिस ईयर आई डी वाई विल बी सेलिब्रेटेड एट ले विच इज़ द कैपिटल ऑफ यूनियन टेरिटरी ऑफ लद्दाख एंड द इवेंट विल बी लेड बाय प्राइम मिनिस्टर इट सेल्फ श्री नरेंद्र मोदी सो वेन इज द इंटरनेशनल डे ऑफ योगा एक्चुअली सेलिब्रेटेड एवरी ईयर इट इज सेलिब्रेटेड ऑन ट्वेंटी फर्स्ट जून ओके सो डू रिमेंबर इट्स एन इम्पॉर्टेंट डेट टू रिमेंबर मूविंग अहेड विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग टेक जायट्स हैज लॉन्च डी जी पाइवर्ट अ स्किलिंग प्रोग्राम डिजाइन फॉर वुमेन इन इंडिया फ्रेंड्स द करेक्ट आंसर इज सी गूगल सो गूगल इंडिया हैज एक्चुअली स्टार्टेड दिस प्रोग्राम एंड इट इज एम्ड एट वुमेन हु आर लुकिंग टू रिटर्न टू देर कॉर्पोरेट कैरियर्स आफ्टर अ ब्रेक और दे आर सिंपली प्लानिंग टू मेक अ कैरियर शिफ्ट टू डिजिटल मार्केटिंग सो दिस इज अ सर्टिफिकेशन काइंड ऑफ प्रोग्राम फॉर सच वुमेन मूविंग अहेड डब्ल्यू एच ओ हेज नाउ ऑफिशियली डिक्लेयर्ड कोविड नाइन्टीन एज एंड फ्रेंड्स वी हैव टू सी द ऑप्शन एंडेमिक पैंडमिक एपिडेमिक द करेक्ट आंसर इज बी डब्ल्यू एच ओ हैज इट डिक्लेयर्ड इट एज अ पैंडमिक लेट्स सी वॉट आर दीज टर्म्स दीज टर्म एक्चुअली मीन बिकॉज इट्स वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंडेमिक वेन अ डिजीज एग्जिस्ट परमानेंटली इन अ पर्टिकुलर रीजन सो वी कैन से दैट मलेरिया इज अ काइंड ऑफ एंडेमिक बिकॉज इट एग्जिस्ट Uh, if we take the example of india it exist al- almost every at every place so this is endemic what is epidemic so epidemic is an outbreak of a disease in a contained area in a limit uh, in a period of time so when ma- many people are uh, attacked by this disease and it spreads in one or several communities at a place now what is pandemic now when this epidemic spreads throughout the world it reaches to the whole globe then it is called pandemic so this coronavirus the disease caused by coronavirus which is covid is now a pandemic next is which of the following state governments is to construct 33 stadiums in the state under uttaran scheme so friends under this scheme assam government is going to develop 33 stadiums of uh, various sports in the state under this scheme so the correct answer is assam now friends we have reached the assignment uh, questions part of the video and i hope if uh, every one of you is going to answer the questions in the comment section so the first is as per a study uh, women on board 2020 by global recruitment tendering platform my hiring club and sarkari naukri info what is india's rank in women pre- uh, member presence on board next which indian state has ranked first in the country for overall implementation of poshan abhiyan as per the recent report of niti aayog next which state topped the list in the installations of solar rooftop plants across the country as of 2nd march 2020 so do na- tell me the name of the state next uh, and an important one recently the gst council has increased the gst on mobile phones from 12% to what percent so this is also a very recent news so do tell me all the answers in the comment sections so friends uh, i hope the session was helpful and uh, thanks a lot for watching if you have liked this video please give it a thumbs up share it with your friends and subscribe to novation and i again tell you that please uh, stay safe stay in your home and follow all the precautions and there will be no need to panic also you can uh, as i told you you can contact me any on any of these social media platforms so all the very best and bye bye until next time